Edexcel GCSE Mathematics, an example of a B grade question. We're asked to make K the subject of the formula in T equals K all divided by K minus 2. So writing out the formula, T equals K all divided by K minus 2. If you wanted to put brackets around k minus 2, you could, uh, and it makes it more easy to see what's actually happening. But now I need to remove that uh, as a fraction. Uh, I don't like that fraction there, so I can easily get rid of the fraction element by multiplying both sides by k minus 2. So t multiplied by k minus 2, which this time I, I definitely will put into brackets, is equal to k. All I've done there is multiply both sides by k minus 2. Now I'm going to expand brackets. So t multiplied by k is kt. t multiplied by minus 2 is minus 2t. And that still equals k. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to add 2t to both sides. Add 2t to both sides. So by adding 2t to the left-hand side, it simply removes 2t and leaves me with kt. When I add 2t to the right-hand side, I'm now left with k plus 2t. And now what I'm going to do is subtract k from both sides. Be careful at this stage, don't think that you can subtract this k because this is, this is multiplying t, so it can't be subtracted. Uh, but we can still subtract k from both sides, and this is what we get, kt minus k on the left. And by subtracting k from the right hand side, we're simply left with 2t. Now what we do is we can factorise the left hand side. We'll see that there's, an, there's k in kt and there's also k in minus k. So we can take k outside of brackets. And what do we multiply k by to get kt? We multiply it by t. And what do we multiply k by to get minus k? We multiply it by minus 1 and this still is equal to 2t. But finally, what we now do is we divide through by t minus 1 on both sides, so we're left with k divided by t minus 1 is k equals 2t divided by t minus 1. And there we are, we've made k the subject of the formula.